Chapter 6! Schemes. What a boring name for a chapter. We've had like, the dragon rises, and the cool thing has happened, and now schemes. <laughs> oh! Oh yeah, I completely forgot it was a stardust. I'm excited to learn what the fuck is wrong with uh, the dude whose name I always forget. Mr. Secret Korean Spy Boy. Yeah, yeah. Dante. She's gone from being a prostitute to being a cos cosmologist? Is that how you say it? I don't know. Well done, Saya. I don't know if you're a prostitute, but you're a prostitute. Yeah, I'm a prostitute. I'm a prostitute. He is the biggest cutie in the world. Hello, buddy. Oh, I'm a prostitute. こちら俺の昔の先輩で警視庁のカーラさんだ。あんたが和樹さんか。よろしくな。警視庁。よろしくお願いします。部外そのおっさん二人で押しかけて悪かったな。いいえ。ところで今日はどんなご用件だ。
You better be hiding off in the background, or you're totally getting me and everyone else killed. Also, I'm putting some of my weapons away because I don't like carrying around this many. My lovely burner can go for now. As much as I love it, it's just not worth using at the moment. Um, demon fire's gotta stay. It's an absolute staple. Insecticide can go. Um, I like the crutch. It's fun. Uh... That can go, I guess. Why does the Kwame... Oh, right, after being used to its limit, then repaired. So I need to break the Kwame Demon Blade, and then have it repaired, and it should be way better. I see, that's an interesting uh, mechanic right there. I think we'll leave it at that right now. And we will, if that's the case, switch to the Kwame Demon Blade as our third. Time to break it to fucking pieces. If it, if it just doesn't work, I'll be so upset. I'm not sure what that is. We know Kiryu. But I also really like having, um... Kaori with me. She's great. Oh. Hey, if it isn't Kiryu-san. Uh. Yuya. Yeah. Been a while, hasn't it? It's good to see you. Hi. Yeah, likewise. I just wish it was under better circumstances. Mm. Why? What's wrong? Hi. Oh, it's Kazuki. He's... Kazuki? He's okay, right? Yeah. Uh... Well, I don't know, actually. Date-san came by for the club for the first time in at least a year, and we were all so stoked to see him, but something must have gone wrong, because Kaski went running out of the club. Maybe. Or because of Date-san? What could have happened? Uh... I didn't want to pry, but he was with another detective, I think. Boy. You know where Date-san is now? He ran out, too. He might have even been chasing after Kaski. <clears throat> This does sound pretty odd. Mm. Look, I know you're worried about this, but don't you think the Amano building should be the real priority here? Uh. You're right. You, uh, we'll catch up soon, okay? If anything comes up in the meantime, though, just give me a call. Hi. All right, will do. I love you, yeah. Uh, I want to be friends with all the old dudes again. Not the old dude, but you know, the people from before. They were great. Ah, uh, you don't know where it is. Yeah, we gotta go find, uh, Amaru, no random civvy's gonna know about this. Uh, out of my goddamn way! Why has the street become so populated recently? Oh no. I'm just gonna quickly head to the tavern and hope I've got time. There you go. Right, buy me some takoyaki because I'm nearly dead. Cheese, cheese and spicy fish. That sounds interesting. Negi, teriyaki and egg. Octopus, please. That'll do. Uh, sour cream fries. Oh man, I fucking adore sour cream. That makes me want sour cream so bad. What, who are you praying to, Kiryu? Jeez, <laughs> there we go. Alright, hopefully that's got those arseholes off my back. Yeah, 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 I've got a fucking idiot to save now. Uh, all the way up in Theatre Square. I'm gonna have to, I might have to take on these arseholes along the way, just because I can't be bothered to get out of their way. But that should be fine, right? Oh no, who are you? And why did you have to be in my way? I can't yeah. avoid you now. What's up, my boy? Mm. Excuse me. Didn't mean to holler at you, man. Name's Michael Naoya. The most banging hip-hop artist on the raw streets of Kimura Cho. Think I can bother a brother to listen to my new mix? Shit's gonna be lit! But I wanna make sure it's got soul, you know? You ready for the sickest flow to hit your ear holes, bro? No. No, that sounds like you're gonna jizz into my fucking lobes. Don't do that. Sure, I'll give it a listen. Hip-hop. I feel like I've heard Haruka mention that genre once or twice. No, Haruka, why? I'm joking. Hip-hop's fine. <laughs> I guess it wouldn't hurt to know what's popular nowadays. Sure, I'll give it a listen. <laughs> what up, brother? Time to start with the flow. Check it. Um, the name is DJ Michael, and I'm- Oh, God, I'm leeching off my parents hardcore. Already in my thirties. Miss me with that bore. Talent don't hit until you've got a little age. Mama says I'm useless, but soon I'll take the stage. Got a negative balance soaking in the bank. The parties at my pad are straight up dank. My mama says she don't even know me anymore. My pop says he's going to kick me out the door. Ain't got a girl, ain't got no cash. If you be trippin', I'll get medieval on your ass. Like, I can't even read it fast enough in this stupid voice. Don't want a job, just want to drop beats. Girly swing by, I give him all the treats. Never leaving home, never leaving home, never leaving home, never leaving home. Phew. Well, what do you think? Give it to me straight, bro. I can take it. Um. 
Uh, it doesn't have much mainstream appeal. And that's just a nice way of saying it was pretty terrible. Oh. Yeah, I know. I've got I've known a while for, I've known for a while my rap game wasn't up to snuff, but I didn't want to accept it, man. Real talk. I've been thinking of dropping off the music scene altogether. Well, don't do that. Guess I really should go through with it, huh? Maybe I'll go work on my family's grave farm or something. I'd be better off picking grapes than spitting rhymes. You don't have to abandon your passion, dude. Here, I don't need this anymore. You can have it, man. What What am I gonna use this for? Am I gonna accidentally get him famous? Uh. Amazing. Thanks. Well, later. <clears throat> what can I possibly do with this CD? Maybe the guys over at Stardust can use it. The guys that we literally jet the Darte potentially just bankrupted, yes. Um, as much as I would love to return it to Stardust, we're a little busy. Let's go find Tamura. I'm sure, I'm sure those precious minutes we've wasted listening to that dude's idiocy definitely didn't get Daigo killed, right? Where are you, buddy? You're in the wall. What are you doing? Ah, Kiryu-san. I'm Marita. I deal in information. Tamura's a friend of mine. He's told me a lot about you. But I should mention that I haven't seen Tamura lately. Hopefully, he'll be back soon. Anyway, if you need anything, I'm happy to help. Um, you know about Kazuki? What? I've got a friend who's worried about him. Any idea where he is? Hmm, sorry. That's news to me. I'll keep my ear to the ground, though. Any word on Daigo Dojima? Hmm, no, actually. There used to be news about him every night, but he's gone dark. Wonder what happened to him. And where's the Amano building? Boy. I'm looking for the Amano building. Know where it is? Oh. Ah, that'd be in front of the children's park. It's been abandoned for a while now, though. I hear this gang of kids has moved into the... has moved in that go by the name 16-Bit. Well, time to get beaten up by Mega Man. What do we got going on? By the way, Kiryu-san, remember that video store, Beam? The one that had all the black market stuff in the back? Rumor has it they changed the password. Okay, but what exactly can we get from there? I don't remember what they used to sell. Huh. If you want the new one, head over to Dabola. Guy named Nida always stands in the corner alone. Drinking. He'll tell you so long as you pay the fee. Alright. Thanks for the tip. I wonder if we'll get a lot of little tips for sub stories from this guy. I miss Tamura though, what the hell happened to him? What's down here? Oh, this is Dabola right here. We don't have time. Don't have time. We'll go back. We'll grab that next when we next uh, do a bodyguard mission if we're in need of cash or something. Because they don't seem to have any kind of story involved with them, unfortunately. So, let's make our way on in. Hello, 16-bit. What's going on? Hmm? This should be the Amano building. But it looks 2D and poorly textured. I don't think we're getting in. Hey! You with those assholes inside? Nanny. I'm sorry. Huh? Playing dumb? What well, drop you, dumb ass? Fuck yeah! Why are you guys the minions? Why are you following the least cool looking of you all? Okay, maybe the dude on the left is the least cool looking, but none of them look particularly great. What does this do? Oh, it's just a double team. Oh my god, that dude doesn't have a brain anymore. Oh, I love those attacks so very much. Let's do one of the, uh, let's do one of our new attacks, shall we? This dude's just getting arse fucked. Poor guy. I mean, they're both getting ruined, but that dude especially is taking a beating. Let's bring down this guy, because I kind of want his baseball bat. Oh, hold on a sec. I completely forgot him that we, uh, we need to use this a little extra. Oh my god, it does less damage than my fists, huh? Oh well, it's gotta be done, I guess. Jesus, that baseball bat does damage. I wonder if I can get some decent heat actions out of this thing, even though it's absolutely pathetic. Listen to the cars fucking honking at me. I'm literally shanking a dude with a katana and you think it's okay to honk? Fuck you. Get out of my way. Oh my god, man. Shut up. Is this gonna be constant? Because that's the most annoying thing in the world mid-fight. Yeah, this is, uh, really awful that I have to use this thing until it breaks, huh? It won't- it won't break. And it- it, it takes ages to hurt anyone with it. Let's see if I can actually do some half-decent damage. Okay, heat moves, however. Heat moves are still damn good. Um, I wonder if I can charge an attack with one of these. I don't know if weapon charge attacks actually exist. 
but we did just like slash these dudes at least 39 times which is a decent amount i guess for now we'll put it away though and i put that away there you go and this dude gets batted <laughs> i really like how strong she is doesn't make any sense and i love it there you go wow you got launched buddy i've always wanted to, to win with a throw attack like that at least now the cars will finally shut up uh, what the hell was that about? This place, it, it was a hideout, man. And these guys speaking another language showed up. You're not with them? Yeah. No, I'm not. But I do want to have some words with them. You know where the key to this place is? Yeah. Our boss carries it on him. He's out right now. Mm. Out? Out where? In the alley behind the drugstore, usually. No way he's just going to give you the key, though. If you kids are anything to go by, maybe he will. Ha! <laughs> go see for yourself, old man. Come on. Oh, come on! Yeah, Kaoru's recently, uh... Our balls have recently dropped, apparently. Right. Where are we going from here, huh? This guy's going to give up the key. I'm sure he will, but I don't know where he is. Oh, miles away! Come on! How many times do I have to run back through these streets tonight? Maybe we'll even take a cab. It's been a while since we've taken a cab. Let's go. I said, let's go. Actually, what's this in here? I mean, if it's right nearby, I can't really turn it down, huh? What is it? Oh, it's just this dude hanging out in the toilet. Oh, yeah, we can finally deliver him his underwear. Man, you have shat... <laughs> it must have been days since you originally shat yourself. I should feel bad. I have some underwear for you. It's probably just a totally different person now. Th thank you so much. Just toss him over the door. Thank you again, my sanitary saint. The name's Baba. What should I call you? Kiryu's fine. You're a lifesaver, Kiryu-san. I'm actually a janitor here, but my stomach started getting queasy between my shifts. At least no one else has to clean up your disaster. I tried to book it to the store, but I think running made it worse, and I ended up paying the dark price. Pooping is a natural thing. You're not the first person to have that happen, and you're not the last. Okay, Kiryu, I'm sure he knows this. You don't need to teach this man first grade science. Right you are, Kiryu-san. Even adults shit themselves sometimes, right? Has it ever happened to you? No. Never. Uh, oh. Anyway, I appreciate the help. If you ever find yourself in a shitty situation, just call me. I'll plunge it for you. Oh my god, we're gonna have him as an ally and he's gonna plunge people with his shitty plunger. Or shit on everyone, that is also an option. Yet another sub-story? Crossed off the goddamn list. And I like getting these done early because it means we'll have more allies as the game goes on, which is never a bad thing. Now where is that little... I'm sure there's one of those, um... Locker keys on the ground somewhere around here. Maybe it's outside. Oh, it was right here. Damn it, you can hear him through walls. That's a little bit annoying. Right, let's take the cab, shall we? It's kind of annoying, because when you take a cab, it doesn't give you the actual map of the game, so I can never really tell where I'm going, but I'm sure this will be fine. Oh, wow. You look just as pathetic as the last three. What do you want? I'm fighting a boss here, man. If you know what's good for you, you'll fuck right off. Hey, you wouldn't know. Is that a Nintendo Switch? What? They, they put a switch in the game? Sure. Hey, you wouldn't happen to be a leader of those 16-bit kids, are you? <laughs> yeah! It's my last continue! Uh -huh. Hey, have you heard a word we've said, little punk? Put down the damn game! Uh -huh. What? Yeah, I heard you the first time, and I said fuck off! I just need the key to the Amano building, and we'll leave you alone. Are you still here? You're throwing me off, asshole! Uh -huh. Sometimes there are more important things in life. No, that's untrue. I'm not even going to read it. Not right now there isn't. Sounds like we're at an impasse. I'm going to kick your ass. Huh? Give me a sec, though. Hello? Sup, bro? I got these assholes giving me shit right now. Uh. Come give me a hand with this, would you? Yeah, right now, man. You actually called in backup? Are we just going to wait around huh? for the... Oh, the dude was just hanging out in that truck, apparently. Yeah, there's my boy. I mean, he doesn't even look mobile. Is it wrong to attack him when he should be on a mobility scooter? Oh god, okay, here we go. Ah, where did you guys all come from? 
Damn, how many boys were just hanging around in the alleys here? You know what? At the very least, it allows me to charge up my terrible katana a little more. Bring it on. Hold the nest. Oh, they're brothers, huh? Makes How many things does this man have to kick at me? Stop it. Oh my god, that's a new one. That was slicing open his stomach. Yeah, let's not do that again. That was kind of cruel. Ow, okay. These guys are tough. We gotta bring down any of the dudes with weapons. Which apparently he drops after only one hit. What a little idiot. Oh my god. We need to get a little bit further away from all this anger, huh? Let's see what we can do. Let's wait for the dude to hit us. And I'll try and parry. Oh, that's new. That is very new and very painful. Fuck you. Oh well. At least, to be honest, once we get, um... Once we get that third attack in the sequence, it does a shitload of damage. I'm kind of enjoying this terrible blade now. Plus, it seems like he's absolutely just stuck. It doesn't seem like there's any way of him to fight back. We can just pin him against the side It Fuck you. That was a great throw, though. I'm almost proud to have been hit by that thing. That was impressive. Stay out of my goddamn way. It looks like with katanas, you just... Are they unstoppable? I don't understand. It seems like they just can't... Um... Oh my god, I'm so sorry. It seems like they just can't be blocked or anything. This dude has been getting cut up with every single strike. It's wonderful. I just wish there was a little bit more 360 hits. Like, if we could slash properly. Oh, I broke the blade. Oh good, it stays in my inventory. I saw it drop on the floor and I was like, Oh fuck, what was I meant to do with that then? Okay, well now, now we don't need to focus on using that bullshit. We can do some actual damage. Give me this thing. Gas canister. This sounds like a horrible idea. Let's do it. Oh, I'm so gonna die. Next hit, I'm dead, I think. Let's grab this thing then. As long as we've got, um, weapons, they just can't do shit to us. Look at the amount of damage we did there. Okay, yeah, the fucking... The awful katana was definitely doing nothing if that little sign could do a thousand times as much damage. Can I slam a dude with a car? Let's find out. Well, this can. This can will work too. <laughs> I don't know why. I really, really like that attack. It just looks nasty. Can we get a nice little double team, girl? Let's do it. Good way to finish the fight, man. I love how coordinated we are. Despite sort of not liking each other. Good. Hand over the key. I've still got my second form. Huh? If it's anything like your first form, you're in for another beating if you don't give us that key. Uh, fine. I'll remember this. Why are you allowing this random police lady? We just murderized some civilians and stole their property. But sure, whatever. Apparently that's not a problem. Let's grab whatever we got here. Nice. Now, is this also really, really far away? Uh, okay, I'll run it and I'll see you guys soon. Also, something's going on at Smile Burger. That sounds like it absolutely needs my attention. In fact, let's actually do that first. I don't know what's wrong with me. I'm addicted to fucking side missions. I really hope you guys don't mind. I feel like I'm not exactly nailing the balance as much as I did last time. I was not even in Smile Burger. Oh, uh, oh. Hello, Darte. So you're telling me I just need this box, and I'll be on the net? Yes, sir! Darte, only meant to be chasing a man down. Connect a cable to the modem, and you'll be ready to go. Connect to... What? The modem, sir. That's what this box is called. Just plug your phone line into it, and voila! The World Wide Web. I don't think I get it. Oh, poor little badass dad over here. Hi. Dante son, what's going on? Oh, hey Kiryu. Sai has been on my back about getting better internet in the house forever. She's always got to have the latest and greatest, you know? Kids these days. I was gonna head to the electronics store, but this guy here said he's selling what I need. Figured I'd hear him out. Always trying to be a good dad, huh? Sai doesn't know how good she has him. Oh. oh, would you like a modem too, sir? We're handing them out as a free promotion right now. Um. Uh, what? Why don't you lend this guy in here too, Kiryu? I can't understand a word of this techno babble myself, but together maybe we can get through it. Yeah, I'll help you out, buddy. All right, I'll stick around for a bit. Not like my friend is about to get shot in the face if I don't haul ass. Thanks, Kiryu. Glad to hear it, sir. Let me start with the explanation. Let me start the explanation over. 
I'm a representative from Happy Net Online, and right now we're in the middle of a free modem promotion. Cool. Free? That's generous of you. Isn't it? Saves me a trip to the store, that's for damn sure. As for speed, we offer a blazing 33.6 kilobytes per second. Oh boy. Would it have been around that speed in 2006? Surely it was better. There isn't a faster provider out there. Kilo... What? Is that like kilometers per hour? Very close, sir. Kilobits per second represents the amount of data sent in a single second. Good one, Kiryu. Yeah, sounds like I'm still more with it than you, Date-san. Now then, uh, 33.6 kilobits per second is equivalent to 33,600 bits per second. 33,600? That's a lot of bits. Indeed it is, it really fucking isn't. This modem is the most advanced tech we've created yet. It's why we want the world to try it. All for free. Well, I get that it's good, but I doubt I'd know how to use it once I had it. That's quite alright, sir. Just give us a call and a happy net employee will come to your house and set up your connection for you. Cool. You guys even have, some, have a support line? Dade, son, why didn't you just call them? You could have, you could have saved yourself this whole trip. Yeah. No, I wanted to handle this. Psyche's making fun of me for being out of touch. So I wanted to prove, up, prove I could keep up with the times. Gives me an idea, Kiryu. Why didn't you get your connection hooked up first? Then you can tell me how you did it. I wouldn't prove anything, then. Look, Sai's killing me these days. Let me look cool for her, just this once. You're a badass cop who saved a life, is that not enough? Uh, fine. I guess I can always return it. Alright, I'll take one. Thank you, sir. The modem is free, of course, but I'll just need your number and email so we can set up your contract. Yeah. Alright, here. Thank you again, sir. Sorry about this, Kiryu. Yeah, right. If you were sorry, you'd be the one signing a contract. Come on, don't be bitter. Guy's gotta impress his daughter every once in a while, right? Speaking of, I should get home. Let me know when you get that thing set up, okay? Will do. See you around, Date. Wait for the Happy Net Online to come. Right? I, I don't think Kiryu even owns a home in Kimurocho anymore, right? Well, that was fucking fast. Did I just sign up to a scam? Hello. Greetings, sir. And thank you for signing up for Happy Net Services. It's Tanabe calling about the modem you needed set up. Wow, you guys won the ball. Thank you for saying so, sir. Now, we understand you'd like a technician to install your modem? Yeah, I don't know much about this stuff, sir. Wonderful, sir. As thanks for... for your joining our network, we'll give you this initial setup for only 50,000 yen. Hmm? I thought this was all supposed to be free. I'm afraid nothing in life is free, sir. But it's a great deal. The service is normally 200,000 yen, so 50k is a steal. That said, there's also an equipment fee of 15,000 yen for annual maintenance, cables, and rental. Uh, may I get your credit card, sir? Hold on. Your salesman never mentioned anything about all these fees. Of course not, sir. All that information is in the contract. You expect the people to actually read that tiny fine print? It's not why you should bury information about fees. That's just business, sir. The moment you signed your name, your, con your contract took le legal binding effect. If this is your business, it's a bad one. Sorry, but I think I need to reconsider this contract. Very well, sir. In that case, cancellation fee would come to... Hmm, 500,000 yen. I'm hanging up now. Are we going to be forever chased down by fucking internet bandits? Is everything about modern technology one big scam? No. Luckily, you've just been the biggest idiot in the world. You didn't even read the goddamn contract, you wang. Fine. Well, let's make up. Wait, where am I? Still pretty far away. You know what? I'm gonna have a little fight over here just to freshen up. And I'll see you guys back over at the one army built. What? What? Oh, ab, b b b ab, 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 Amano building. That's what it's called. Well done, mate. Oh, I forgot you were even around, Gaby.